Hello, 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 it's an Esther 27 coming to you guys with another live Wi-Fi battle today against Tony Daddy. If you haven't heard of him, go check him out in the description below. He does also Pokemon stuffs. I think he wants to be doing a Wi-Fi battle. I think this is a UU match, I'm pretty sure. I think that's what I told him. So here's fingers crossing that it, it is. Uh, hopefully he brings in all legit Pokemon. That seems to be a problem with this generation. But yeah, it looks like he's got all UU mons. I'm not looking too forward to this because I got my Chestnut, my Florges, my Seismic, Toad, my Gonzalez, my Jolteon, my Mega Sceptile, and my Regirock. So it looks like we might have a problem against these. Uh, this, this says the Steelix might be a problem. The Raikou can be dealt with unless it has HP Grass, which would be annoying. Empoleon can get switch turned, Volt switch turned. Uh, and yeah, I don't. Uh, Raikou can't get anything, any Volt Absorber, something like that. He only gets pressure. And. I'm not too sure what Steelix... Steelix's type is something. What is Steelix's type? Ah, uh, fuck. I'm actually gonna have to look this up right now. I thought... I think it's... I think it's Steel Ground, but I want to make sure right now. Um, um, yeah, it's Steel Ground. Okay, so Volt Switching would not be a good idea. Plus he has a High Dragon, or the Fly Gun, so that'd be annoying. But, I don't really see the use of Rock, so I'm actually gonna lead off with... with Boil. Because he can do a decent, some decent work against most of his team, actually. So that'd be very good for us. Nothing is, nothing really can take him on besides the Raikou, unless if it has HP Grass. So we'll be taking on Tony. Good luck, my friend. Um, for question of the day today, um, let's see what is. <laughs> oh my God. What are you guys looking forward to during your Christmas break? I'm not on Christmas break right now, which is very unfortunate. We are going to be... I have, like, until Friday, this Friday. So that's going to be pretty annoying. So I'll be taking on a Serpenter. I don't know what you're going to plan on doing. You have garbage defenses. So I can go for a Hydro Pump. Or I can go for an Earth Power. I don't want to risk the miss right now. And I don't want him... I don't want to risk the miss, plus, I, as far as I remember, Steelix doesn't have the best special defense. Although I'm nearly certain it is Mega's, Mega, what's it called, Steelix. So that's going to be a bit more bulky. So I'm actually going to go for an Earth Power, predicting possibly the the uh, Toxic Croak. Because I knew he'd probably want to switch out. I was going to bring Goggles, his Flygon. Yup, I should have gone for the Hydro Pump. Because I was debating if he wanted to bring in the Flygon or the... Uh, that stupid high, uh, toxic croak for high water absorb, but it doesn't look like he was gonna risk it this early. I'm gonna bring in not today because he might just go for a straight U turn, which would be a very annoying play, but I don't really know if I can do anything else. So I'm just gonna switch out. I'm pretty sure this thing is probably scarfed in, or yeah, that's probably the way it wants to be. Uh, let's see. He's gonna go for the Giga Drain. Oh, okay. I didn't. What? This thing can learn Giga Drain? I didn't even know that goggle, that Flygon can learn Giga Drain. That is news to me, actually. That is very interesting stuff. I'm actually going to go for the Leech Seed. I do not remember if any of his Pokemon want to take Leech Seed. No, I don't think any of them can. So he's going to switch out. So that's pretty much guaranteeing the fact that he is choice in some way. So he's going to bring out the Toxic Croak. I'm going to go set up this powerful Leech Seed on the Toxic Croak. Now I gotta, I'm almost certain he's gonna go for the poison type move this turn. So, I might just switch into, I might just switch into, it's gonna be a very annoying cycle if I just keep switching Pokemon. I can wither away this guy if I really wanted to. Yeah, I'm gonna go for the spike. Ah! I can't really go for the spiky shield because that's gonna, that's gonna lead me in a very bad position. But if he goes for, because if he goes for the substitute, I can't do anything about it. Damn, this is a very bad position. But if I... Ah, oh, damn, this is actually really sucks. I'm actually going to... I can bring in Heavy. Heavy didn't really serve that much of a purpose this game. So I'm actually going to go into Heavy. Yeah, let's go into Retro Rock right now. Go for... Let's predict the Poison Jab. because I'm going to be very annoyed if he ends up going for the... I don't think he can learn... Actually, he can learn Swords Dance, so it's going to be pretty annoying if he does go for that. If he's a special variant, I'll be very annoyed. But no, he's going to go for the Poison Jab, as predicted. I'm going to be able to eat that up very nicely. Yum, yum, yum. You have Black Sludge, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, you have Black Sludge, so that didn't do nearly as much as it could have. Sorry, Tony. Actually, I run the exact... I run Black Sludge on my Toxic Croak sometimes. I usually try to go with Life Orb because it's not that powerful. And usually when I don't even have a setup move or 
yeah, when I don't have like something like nasty plot or some or um, nasty plot or that stupid move, uh, sword dance. Yes, yeah, sword dance. I usually just try to have life orb so I can actually have some nice uh, residual. I'm gonna actually gonna switch out into Florges and go. Actually, do I want to take that hit? Yeah, let's go. He's been pretty obvious so far, so I'm actually gonna go with the bringing the floor just right now, because I'm gonna slowly try to try to get this going. I'm gonna keep switching out these mines. Hopefully, he doesn't predict that. He's gonna go for the drain punch as predicted. That's not gonna do diddly squat. Actually, that did a lot more than I was expecting. A lot more than I was hoping for too. Okay, so these this poison touch is also gonna poison me, which sucks, man. Sucks. All right, you know, lesson learned. Lesson learned. Don't be doing that shit. Don't be trying to... Don't be trying to do this. Okay. Okay, what can I do right now? I'm almost certain he's going to try to do a drain punch this turn. Because we... Last time... and then Actually, since we are poisoned... Actually, he doesn't have... If he, he doesn't have dry skin, that's very important to remember. Um, I'm not in a very good position for anything right now. Which really sucks. I really just... I'm... What, I was going to protect, but I don't think I can right now. So I'm actually going to switch into boil right now. Predicting the poison jab. Or he might actually go for the drain punch. Uh, let's go with the poison jab. Let's go with the poison jab. Let's, yeah, he's going to switch out right now. I think he might have thought that he couldn't kill me. So he's going to bring in the Empoleon. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. You're going to bring that thing in. I have a Seismitoad ready for you, my friend. Just for you. Alright. So last time he ended up switching out into the Flygon. I'm going to assume that he's probably going to try to do that again on me. I'm going to go for the Focus Blast this time around because I can't really risk it going I can't really risk going for anything else at this point. So here's hoping that he actually brings in the uh, Flygon. Actually, I might just I should have just yeah, I should have gone for the Earth Power this turn. Actually, no, no, no. Focus Blast is definitely the best play because it hits everything minus the size, minus that Spear Tomb. But I don't think that he'd want to bring it. If he brings in the Spear Tomb right now, I'll be very much surprised. If that, if he brings that in, because Seismitoads, by the way, I'm like bringing this thing in, seems to be pretty bulky. So the fact that he would bring that thing in just to take an Earth Power when he can just bring in a Levitating Flygon, that just baffles me. So I'm just going to go for the Focus Blast. If he brings in the, the Spear Tomb, I'll just deal with that later. But for now, I'm just going to hope to God that he brings in the... Uh, the Just stays in, actually. He's going to withdraw. Probably bring in the Empoli or the Flygon right now. Go for oh my fucking God! He did not just do that! Okay. Alright. Alright. I see you, big dog. I see you. And I go for the Focus Blast. So that's not going to be doing anything. Alright. What does Spirit Tomb even do? What does Spirit Tomb even do anymore? I don't know what a Spirit Tomb does. That's the thing. I don't know if it wants to be... I feel like Dark... I feel like it has... I feel like Energy Ball is a thing on this thing. I really feel that Energy Ball is a thing. But I can take... Let's go for a Hydro Pump. And see what he wants to go for. I'm going to miss my Hydro Pump. Because why not? He's going to start sending up on me. Because, you know. Why wouldn't I want it? Why wouldn't I miss my shit? Just why not? <laughs> that's just garbage. I should not have missed that move. <laughs> Alright. That's just stupid. I'm just going to go into floor just right now. I'm sick of this. I'm sick of just trying to take this thing on. I can't even 2 it KO this this uh, Spirit Tomb at this point. So I'm going to have to bring in floor just for this. I'm going to bring go for the Dark Pulse. I resist that. I should be fine. Yeah, even at plus one, you... <laughs> wow, nice and voice crack right there. But yeah, that Dark Pulse really doesn't do anything. I'm going to go for the Aromatherapy this turn because I can't... I don't think a uh, set... Not nah, 80... Spirit Tomb, yeah, that's what it's called. Can do anything to me. So I'm going to get rid of this poisoning because it's bothering the fuck out of me right now so i don't know i don't know what you're gonna be doing right now but i am really i really just want school to be over right now i don't know how many of you guys are still in school right now but it sort of sucks with the fact that all my friends are about to finish school today the day that this goes up but 
And that's just how the cookie crumbles, I guess. I knew that the Empoleon would come out. If I really wanted to, I could have just gone for the, um, brought in my actual, uh, my Seismitoad. But I really just need to get rid of this poison right now. I can't deal with the poison anymore. I just need Florges to be healthy again. So right now, I'm actually going to go for a Protect. I don't know what this Empoleon's planning to do right now. Or, 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 I can bring in Flash Cannon. Uh, flash Cannon. Flash Cannon is almost obvious as hell. But I'm not really willing to risk it right now. I'm going to go for a Protect. Trying to see what he wants to go for. Scout out what this Empoleon's going to be doing. You're going to go for a Flash Cannon, right? Yeah, Flash Cannon. So, knowing that right now, I can actually switch into Seismitoad and eat up that move. Like, easily. <sighs> Bring in Boil. Eat up the incoming Flash Cannon. If he wants to go for the Water move, that's fine with me too. If he wants to go for the Ice Beam, that's fine. That's not Stab. I should be fine. And I don't... I think the last move that uh, Empoleons tend to have, if they're all-out attackers, tends to be a... a, a fl I think Dark Pulse or something like that. I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure what Empoleon offensive tends to be. Yeah, it's going to go for the Ice Beam just like I thought. I should be able to be fine. Yeah, that didn't do nearly as much as it, <laughs> as much as I thought it would. Um, what to do with the Empoleon? I am. I don't want to stay in. I'm gonna go for an Earth Power. I'm gonna go for. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's stupid. Flygon's being a problem right now. But if I can, if I can, you know, I'm gonna double out. I'm going to double out right back into floor, just predicting him to switch into one of those. Let's go with that move. Uh, boy, will come back right now. I'm going to attempt my best to try try to do this, make, and make up for this lost, lost ground. Nope, he's going to go for the Ice Beam again. Nope. All right, so I'm predicting very poorly right now. I am very much annoyed right now. I know I can't live a Flash Cannon, but I'm going to go for a Wish. I'm going to go for a Wish this turn. It's uh, going to go for a Flash Cannon. I'm not too sure if I can live this from this range. I'm able to live, thankfully. And I'm going to go for a Wish. I'm going to let myself gain my HP back because I can't deal with this shit anymore. <gasps> I can't deal with this! Alright. Empoleon, you're annoying me right now. I'm going to Protect. I'm going to get my HP back. Go for whatever move you want. I don't care. You can switch out for all I care. You can, but this is pretty much your best. Actually, if he brings in the toxic group, I'm sort of screwed right now. But <sighs> let future us deal with it. Uh, current us still has to deal with the fact that this Empoleon is still doing some massive work against us. I'm not too. <laughs> oh my god. Ah, uh, this is gonna be a hard battle. This is what happens when I can't bring in all the UU mods I like to bring. I still okay. Probably during winter break, I will be switching, bringing all my mons back from uh, X, from X and Y to Oras, because that's going to be the plan. It's going to go for the Flash Cannon. That's not going to do diddly squat to me. Bring back all my HP. So I'm going to be at essentially full health once again. I can't really do much against this Empoleon, because I don't have... I essentially just showed him my entire move pool. So I'm actually going to switch into Boil. I can lift two Ice Beams if it came down to it. So... Come back, Florges. Come back. Um, go boil. I believe in you. I believe in you. If you go, if he goes for the flash cannon, uh, yeah, he's getting a little antsy with it. He's gonna go for the safe flash cannon. That's not gonna do. Oh my god, that did a lot more than I was expecting. That did a bit more than I was expecting. All right. Um, how can I? How can I deal with this? How may I deal with this? You know what? Very tempted to go for the earth power again. Very tempted. But Hydro Pump is going to miss, almost guaranteed. But let's go for Earth Power. He's going to go for the Ice Beam. I should be able to live this. I should be able to live this. Please don't. Oh my god. Frozen! Just why the fuck not? Why? Why not? Just. Why not just get me frozen? Just. I don't see why not. Can I predict him to go for the Flash Cannon now? I'm going to predict him to go for the Flash Cannon. I'm going for the Earth Power. I'm going to predict him to do that. If he goes for the Ice Beam, a floor just would eat it up. So he has to go for the Flash Cannon. Yup! Predicted! Come on, Sazmatoad. You have to fucking wake up. At, you have to break through this. Come on! Wait! God! <sighs> I 
I, I'm not in range where I can live another one. However, Sesmato is very important right now. I can bring in Gonzalez and then scare him out. That's what I can do. I can scare him out with Gonzalez. But boy, I don't need... Damn, this is very annoying to me right now. What can I do? What is the best play? Boyle is very much needed still. I'm almost certain he's going to go go for another. I'm actually going to have to stay in. I can't really do anything. He goes for he's going to go for the ice beam. Yeah, I knew it. I knew he'd go for the ice beam. This is very that's so annoying. Fucking hacks, man. That's so that's so booty. All right, what can I do now? I'm going to bring in Gonzalez. And since I don't even have HP ice, this is going to be a problem. I'm going to predict the hydro uh, the Flygon to come in right now. What can I do against the Flygon now? I can go for a... I forgot what hidden power I even have. I think it might be dark. No, it can't be dark. It might be dragon. I think it might be dragon. <sighs> but what The Empoleon is still needed because he needs to take out my Regirock. And this is the best Pokemon that I'd take it. But I can go... Shadow Ball is the safest play. I'm going to go for a Shadow Ball. Just... Should I... Yeah, I'm going to go for a Shadow Ball. It's going to withdraw. Bring in the impo, the, the Flygon, right? Serpenter. Uh, it's going to bring in the Steelix. All right. Um, I forgot that this thing was still around. I'm going to go for the Shadow Ball. This should do a good chunk to the Serpenter. That did more than I was expecting. But... This thing's going to Mega Evolve go for the Earthquake, so that's not exactly optimal. Nor do I have really anything to take it on, so I'm actually going to have to switch on to Chestnut right now. Because I can't can't afford Gonzalez to be dying, because this is the only thing that can take on the the floor, the uh, the Empoleon as of right now. So he's going to Mega Evolve into Mega Steelix, so it was a good thing that I switched out. Mega Steelix looks like a freaking weirdo. don't know why it's so, so powerful right now, the fact that it has like... A, mag a gravitational field around it, so it's going to be able to just do whatever. It's going to get a critical hit, so it's whatever. It's not going to be doing too much, so I'm going to be fine. I will be much dandy, very much good and dandy. I don't think a Serpenter wants to be staying around against a brick against a Chestnut right now. So I'm going to set up a Leech Seed. Just whatever wants to come in is going to get leeched. If a Serpenter wants to stay in, I think Ice Fang shouldn't kill me from this range. It's not Stab, so there's that. Plus I'm Impish, so... Chestnut should be able to live whatever one move uh, the Serpenter wants to go for. I probably should have gone for the, uh, the, 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 the words. The words, they're not coming to me right now. Uh, the, 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 the Brick Break right now, because the Empoleon's probably going to come out right now. Or the Spiritomb. Spiritomb's probably coming out. Now, to bring in Goggles, the, uh, the Flygon. I'm going to go for the Leech Seed right now. Give me, give me some of that health back. I could, it'll be nice to, I'm going to go for the spiky shield just to see what this thing wants to go for because it's going to be chest choice scarfed or choice in some way, shape or form. By the way, he's bringing it in. He's probably going to go for an ice beam this turn or a flamethrower, one of the two. So I'd like to see what he's going to go for and then see from there, go for the spiky shields. And this is the only way I'm going to be able to get rid of this, these mons, just slowly wither them away. I don't have a seismitoid anymore. He's going to go for the heat wave. Since it is choice, I should be fine in, to switch into my my Regirock right now and go for... I can't... I'll be fine if I go into Floor just right now, actually. So I'm going to bring in Floor just right now, because I'll be able to eat that up. Go for a Wish, and then go from there. Alright, bring in the Floor just. He's going to go for the Heat Wave once again. And that shouldn't do dilly squat to me. Please don't burn me. Thank you. Thank you for not burning me. And right now, I'm almost certain, almost certain that this Flygon is going to be uh, gonna be switching out right now. Into what? I'm almost certain that he's going to bring in the Empoleon right now. If he brings in the Empoleon, I can bring in um, Gonzalez and go for a Thunderbolt that turn. So I'm actually going to do that right now. I'm actually going to do that right now. Or I can go into heavy and go for a drain punch. But I'm not going to be able to outspeed that. Chestnut can't... Chestnut can't live in ice beam, I think. 
Wait, it's not life orb or choice back, so I think I can live one. So let's, yeah, let's do that, let's do that, let's do that. Let's let Tony Daddy switch out his goggles right now and bring in the, what the heck? Bring in the Raiko. A Raiko, all right. And pressure me all you want. What is this thing gonna do now? Extra sensory is the thing on this Pokemon, I just remembered. All right, I'm predicting a little bad. My predictions are going a bit far off. I might have... All right. Extra sensory is a thing, but it's not enough for me to actually be scared of it, because it is... If it's choice specs, then it'll do a lot of damage, but it shouldn't kill, because it, it is relatively low base power, plus it's not stab. So... Seed Bomb is probably my best play right now. He's going to go for the Reflect... I have Brick Break, actually. Ooh, I'm gonna, I'm about to break that shit. Let me just let you have your moment right now. Let you think you're eating up this shit. Let me set up this Leech Seed as well while you're trying to use this shit. Calm mind all you want. He's gonna try setting up on me. What the heck, man? What do you think you're doing right now, Mr. Tony Daddy? I'm gonna set up this Leech Seed on you. Get rid of the resi- get some residual on you. I'm pretty sure you're life orb by the looks of it. You might be light clay, I'm not too sure, but I'm gonna break this- this incoming- this reflect right now, just cause I can't deal with it. It's gonna go for a calm mind once again. I'm gonna break your thing right now. I'm gonna break that stupid, uh, the thing, the reflect right now. So that's gonna be gone. Break it! There we go. And the Reflect wore off. I'm going to get some nice Leech Seed action right now. Now the question is... <sighs> nearly certain that he's going to go for... That he's not going to go for another Calm Mind right now. So I'm actually going to go for a Spiky Shield. Actually, he might... He can't go for a, a Reflect because that would be a waste of a turn. He might just try to sa salvage this thing. But the can't, this thing can't really do much to my team. So he might just let this thing die right now. So I'm actually going to go for a Spiky Shield. Spiky Shield might be a good play. C Wait, he has Reflect and Calm Mind. There's no way he has Extra Sentry to go along with it. So he has Thunderbolt and something else. Something weird. Probably Dark Pulse or maybe. I don't know. Maybe HP Ice. Eh, that's not too good. But go for a Spiky Shield. Let's see what he wants to go for. If he goes for the attacking move, then that'd be good. If he doesn't, then uh, he's going to go for the Thunderbolt, just like I thought. And it looks like I'm going to be able to take out this Raikou next turn. Uh, I'm not too sure what I want to go, if I want to let... I think Chestnut should be fine to live. Um, or I can be cheeky and let... I can't risk Gonzalez. I'm not going to risk Gonzalez. Uh, I'm not going to risk him. So I'm just going to go for a Brick Break. Just in case he wants to set up a reflect this last turn, he's gonna go for the Thunderbolt. That shouldn't kill me, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it didn't. He has Life Orb, so that's fine. And yeah, I should have switched into. I couldn't risk switching into Gonzalez because that could have been very bad. So I'm gonna get some of my HP back. Thankfully, the right code's now gone, but it didn't really serve that much of a threat right now, so I'm sort of annoyed. It also is very annoying the fact that the Empoleon, I, my thing that would take on the Empoleon is now sort of hurt. This Pokemon right here is actually very hurt right now. It's gonna bring in the Toxicroak. Ah, what can I do against this shit? I can go for a Spiky Shield, but I'm almost certain he's gonna go for a set. Can I go... Should I go for the Spiky Shield? I feel like a Substitute's coming my way right now. I can't... Re I can't do anything against this guy right now. This Toxicroak is being a problem. I don't have anything for it. Go for the Leech Seed. Uh, if he wants to set up a Bullet Punch, let's go. You can't kill me that way. I'm sorry, friend. Oh my god, a Poison Touch! He got the poisoning. Set up my Leech Seed right now. Go for it. I don't care. And right now, I can just... Why would you go for a Bullet Punch? That's my question. I'm not too sure what it could... Actually, you might have thought that the... Uh... I'm not too sure, I'm not too sure. He might have thought the Regirock was coming in, predicting the Poison Jab, and he didn't want to use a Drain Punch. So, maybe that. Maybe he thought that the... Uh, spiky Shield, it would out-prioritize the Spiky Shield. I'm not too sure. But I'm just going to go for the Spiky Shield this turn. So, that's going to be... It's just going to protect me one more turn. Uh, 
get rid of this a uh, little bit more of HP on this thing. He's going to go for the Poison Jab, but once again, Spiky Shield's going to hurt him. He's going to get a little bit back from the, the uh, Black Sludge, but I will take that, plus a little bit more with the with the Leech Seed right now, so that's going to be pretty good. But I'm, <laughs> I'm stressing right now, fam. I'm stressing right now because I don't know what to do with this stupid Toxicroak. I need a decent switch out. I can't afford to let anything else to take this. I can't really let anything else take this thing on. <sighs> I might just have to let Not Today die right now. Yeah, I'm just going to let him die right now. I'm just going to go for the Seed Bomb. It's going to go for the Poison Jab. I'm dead right now. There's no way I'm living at this point. Oh, I lived! With whatever health I have, I'm getting... I'm going to get whatever damage I can on you. So I'm going to be able to get a uh, leech seed on him that's gonna be pretty nice because poison is the last uh residual move that happens thankfully so i'm actually gonna be able to get the leech seed off on him before dying that's pretty nice that's very nice but i actually i think we'll actually love this poisoning right now because we did get 12 percent with the point with this leech seed so actually i'm gonna go for a spiky shield again let this toxic croak take the extra damage he actually might switch out right now yeah, he's probably gonna switch out right now. Yep, <laughs> I should. I can't. I can't risk it. He's so gonna send out the spirit tomb. Whatever. Whatever. It's not that big of a deal. It's. <laughs> it's gonna annoy the hell out of me right now. Whatever. Um. I don't know what to do right now. I don't know what to do. I'm gonna die to this poisoning. Oh, I level one HP. Not bad. Not bad, but he's going to go for the Shadow Sneak, so I'd much rather let Chestnut die right now. Unless Ch the Spirit Tomb does not have sp Shadow Sneak, so that, that'd that be very interesting to see. But it, I'm almost certain that the Spirit Tomb will have it, so uh, come on. You know you want to show it. You know you want to show it. Ah, my core is broken. That's the only annoying thing right now. I'm going to set up this Leech Seed, and I probably should have gone for the... Actually, uh, oh, I don't know. I don't know what the correct play was. I probably should have gone for the... Uh, right now, I'm gonna... I'm gonna send out Heavy. I'm gonna send out Heavy, start going for some uh, rock, rock smashes. Or not rock smashes, some rock slides. Or I can set up rocks. Actually, yeah, let's set up rocks. Because I'm sick of him being able to switch out willy-nilly like this without any uh, any sort of residuals. So that's going to be a nice for me. I'm going to get that powerful Stealth Rocks up right now. Very late game Stealth Rocks, but it'll be nice to have. He's going to try setting up on me. That's going to be very interesting with the fact that he has uh, the Leech Seed on him. So he's going to be <laughs> sort of thrown off with the fact that he's going to be doing this again. All right. All right, mister. Let's see what we can do right now. Let's think. Let's think. I can... Dark Pulse shouldn't kill me from this range. I'm going to go for a Rock Slide. I can possibly flinch this thing to death, and that could be nice for me to finally get some hacks on my side. Okay, there we go. There we go. Some nice little hacks right there. Leech Seed should do something to it, and uh, this thing is very bulky physically because my my uh, Regirock is fully is adamant full attack, so there's that. I'm going to go for a Rock Slide again. If he wants to keep the Spear Tomb in, that's fine with me. going to get this thing even lower of HP. I'm pretty sure I should be able to live one Dark Pulse with only plus one. And I get another flinch! Fuck yeah! Fuck yeah! Let's go! Let's go! Let's get some hacks on our side. The game is balancing out a bit. The game is balancing out very much in our favor right now. The tides are churning. Let's get it! Um... I sort of want to predict... No, the Spirit Tomb's not going to be able to live a, rock, a Stealth Rock come in right now so he's gonna have to let this thing die so there we go get that fucking spear tomb out of here we can go for fighting type moves all we want right now that's very nice but now the question is what can we do what can we do with this he's gonna bring in the toxic croak toxic croak is gonna be very annoying with the fact that it can just go for a drain punch and get a lot of hp back i'm gonna have to <laughs> it's very annoying but i think i'm gonna have to oh he's gonna bring in the goggles Earth power is coming my way. Earth power is definitely coming my way. Ah. Or focus blast. I'm thinking right now. If I go 
for a drain punch. I can probably live in Earth Power. Actually, no. Regirock has pretty garbage special defense. I am at full HP, though, and it's if it's probably Choice Scarfed. Uh, what can I do? Let's go for a Drain Punch. I don't think Heavy really can do much. He's going to go for the Earth Power. Come on, Heavy. You can live this. You can live this. Come on, buddy. And he lived. And he lived. There we go. You get some nice hella damage on this goggles right now. Nope, like, no damage more like it. Fuck. That is very not bueno right now. Ugh. Ugh. Damn. Alright. I would still prefer to have Regirock around, but I can't really let anything else take hits right now. So I'm going to have to let him die. And now the question is, is this thing Choice Scarfed or Choice... And probably choice scarf by the fact that we were able to live a an earth power. So I'm gonna bring in Braza just in case he wants to be choice scarfed. Because I do resist the earth power and I don't want Gonzalez to be taking that. So I'm gonna mega evolve and right now, best move. I don't think anything resists Leaf Blade besides uh Leaf Blade, Leaf Blade, Leaf Blade. Uh uh, uh Leaf Blade. If he brings in the seismic, the toxic croak, I can go for a dragon claw, but I can't afford. He's gonna bring in serpenter, which is his steelix right now. That thing's gonna be fucking bulky as hell. I just remembered. Oh, that thing's like not gonna lose any HP. Mega evolve right now. It's very annoying with the fact that we're physically oriented. Oh, this thing's gonna eat up our attack. I don't even want to see how pitiful this damage is gonna be. Go for the leaf blade. Please do a decent chunk. That did like 2 HP, are you fucking kidding me? That did like 2 HP. What can we do? <laughs> what does a Mega Steelix even do? What kind of move can Steelix even learn? That's my question. Uh, Steelix, what can you learn? Can you learn anything Fire, Fire Fang maybe? I think you can learn Fire Fang. Or Ice Fang. Ooh, Ice Fang might be a thing. Yeah, I might go for the Ice Fang right now. Either way, I just can't do anything. Yeah, I'm gonna have to switch on to Gonzalez right now. I'm gonna hope that I can eat up an Ice Fang. I'm gonna hope that I can eat up an Ice Fang. Come on, Gonzalez, I believe in you. <laughs> You're the one Pokemon that you've. Explosion! <laughs> well, there goes Gonzalez. That's very bad. Critical hit on me, too. That's very... Add salt to the wound right there. Add salt to my wounds right now. Bring in Braza right now, but I just don't know how, if, even if we're going to be able to win this battle. I don't think we are, because... <sighs> Fuck. Toxic Crook. Okay, we can take this thing on one-on-one. -on -one. We outspeed it, and it, if it gets Sucker Punch, it's not going to be able to kill us. So we'll be fine. I'm going to go for a Dragon Claw. Uh, just to be safe. Goes for the Sucker Punch, I'll be fine. Yeah, it doesn't seem like he wants to go for the Sucker Punch, so it should die to a Dragon Claw. There we go, Toxic Croak. But it looks like it's going to be a very bad 1 or 2 0 on his favor. It's very annoying how that. <laughs> that explosion was clutch right there. I will give him that much. That explosion was clutch right there. I'm not going to be able to live an Ice Beam, unfortunately. I can't residual the fuck out of this guy. Um trying to think yeah there's nothing i can do all i can do is go for an ice beam and pray or leaf blade and pray i get a crit right now but i don't think that's happening that did a good chunk that oh if i got a crit i could have won if i got a crit he got a crit come on even though it didn't matter it just would have been nice to actually get it but whatever it looks like it's gonna be a very bad 2-0 on his part very close 2-0 well not really not really that close but whatever that's going to be the game, I'm pretty sure. I'm not going to be able to do anything against this uh, Empoleon, unfortunately. Not unless I want to stall it out. Unless I can get, like, special attack drops. I don't know. I'm not going to... Yeah. I'm going to Moonblast you. You're going to go for the Flash Cannon. I'm not sure if I'll be able to live this at all, to be honest. I live that with pretty good health. Even for that to be super effective. Go for the Moonblast. How much is this going to do, if anything? That does a respectable amount. I don't get a special attack drop. Why would I? Why would I get that kind of last minute hex? Alright, um... Okay, 
This might be a last ditch effort. This is gonna be a last ditch effort right now. Uh, yeah. Last ditch effort. Let's get this wish going and pray that we can live a flash cannon from this range. Live with 4 HP, let's go. Uh, wish right now, and, uh, come on. Come on, this is our only shot right now. <laughs> if we can get rid of this Empoleon, we'll be fine. Um, I'm actually going to have to go for Protect. I'm going to pray that I can get a special attack drop on the next one. That's all I can hope for. That's all I can hope for. That's the only way we'll be able to win, is if we can get that kind of hex on our side right now. Oh, God, this is going to be very... Feather Dance. <laughs> Come on, you're trying to get rid of my physical defense and your special attacker. I don't know it. Feather Dance gets rid of physical attack. What? What are you doing? I'm confused. All right, we should be able to live one of these... Uh, these, 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 ah, uh, what's it called? These, this flash cannon. So I'm gonna go for another wish. Just gonna go for a, for a flash cannon once again. I'm gonna try to get as high of HP as I can. That's not gonna be a thing anymore. Wish again, wish upon a star. Once again, my friend. Yes, I know, I'm being that guy, but I don't know. I can't really risk it. This is my only shot. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit right now. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit. Go for the moon blast. Go for the feather dance. Go for the feather dance. Actually, I should have gone for the protect because now I'm just playing into his game. Just gonna ride the surf. I think I can live this. I think I can live this. Hello, hello, survival. Hello, survival. Let's go. Get the special attack drop. Come on, get the special attack drop. There we go. 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 Defiant. I don't care. You can get plus one attack or plus two attack. You don't have. You don't have physical attack, you have special attack. I don't care. Minus one special attack, that's all I care about. Alright, now, we might be in business. We might be in business right now. We might be in business right now. Go for the wish again, and pray that we can... He's gonna withdraw, alright. He's gonna withdraw, send out goggles. Um, should've gone for the moon blast this turn, oh well gonna be at pretty good health after this so that's nice if he goes for the earth power I'm actually gonna I'm actually gonna protect so I can get as much HP back as I can against this thing yeah I'm gonna protect this turn I can't afford this thing to be getting getting a crit on me so I'm gonna protect I'm gonna be trying trying my best to do this right now he's gonna go for the earth power like I thought all right this is <laughs> <laughs> this is such a cheap way of trying to get this W right now, but this is the only way we can do it. Actually, I should have gone for the Witch and then gone for the Moon Blast. That's what I should have done. I should have done that, because right now, I would have been at full health after getting rid of the Goggles, as opposed to whatever health I have right now. So there's that. Um, what can we do? We're at a range where we can live, I think, two, two of those... I'm actually going to go for a Protect. No, I'm going to go for a Wish. And then I'm going to... Because, like, he just got a little bit of residual right there with the... With that. So I do I go for a Wish or a Moon Blast. Oh, this is a very difficult situation right now. Um, Let's go for a Moon Blast. Let's go for a Moon Blast. I'm going to go for the Flash Cannon. I could have gone for a Protect this turn, actually. That would have been very dickish of me. But whatever, I'm going to be going for a moon blast. I'm gonna pray that I get the special attack drop again. Come on, come on, give it to me. Give it to me this time. Damn it. Fuck. All right. This is gonna be the best. This is gonna be as close as it's gonna get for me right now. This is gonna be as close as I can get to actually killing this thing. So I'm gonna go for the moon blast. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit. Flash cannon, please don't kill me. Okay, survive. Come on. Come on, Florida. Just pull through right now. Pull through. Pull through. Come on. Yes. I got a credit. I won. Oh, the comeback. Oh, my God. We did. Oh, my God. The powerful comeback is real. Oh, my God. Oh, Jesus. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. All right. All right. That I'm sorry, Tony. I'm sorry if that I don't know if that crit mattered or not, but 
at the end of the day, we can't control Hex. But <laughs> if you guys did enjoy that very close battle, wow, this has been pushing 40 minutes already. But if you guys did enjoy, make sure to hit that like button. Make sure to check out Tony in the description below. Make sure to answer the question of the day, which is, what are you guys planning to do over Christmas break? And if you aren't already, make sure to hit that, that subscribe button in this video, Nestor. And I'll see you guys later.